see this ruling party in yeah. India yeah, yeah. is communalizing everything. Yeah. If you see, taste the Vedanta or anything like that, yeah, there's yeah. Nothing, no, nothing wrong in that. I was instrumental in starting science. Dear yeah, friends, today we have the privilege of being in the presence of E.T. Muhammad Bashir Sahab, a true visionary leader and the member of the parliament from Kerala. Our guest speaker has dedicated his entire life for the upliftment of the downtrodden and the needy. Bashir Sahab has successfully led numerous initiatives that have had a profound impact on Indian politics. But it is not just his political engagements and professional achievement that make him special. Bashir Sahab is a passionate advocate for educating the next generation on the importance of getting education and being a true citizen. His engaging speaking style and ability to connect with audiences of all backgrounds make him an inspiration to many. Today, Bashir Sahab will be sharing his insights on the undiscovered history and truths, of course, related to his place. He is residing a place called Konnara Makam, which is historically very significant and socially relevant. Get ready to be inspired, challenged and empowered to take action. Dear friends, please join us in giving a warm welcome to the exceptional leader, E.T. Muhammad Bashir Sahab. My own English. English is better. Okay. I am happy to have a talk with you. Thank you very much. My village it is known as uh, Mapram and Konnaru. Konnaru is the old name. We are proud of our uh, significance in the history. Because uh, this area, you may be knowing that this area was really very, very important and noted in the history, especially in 1921 Malabar Revolution. The Konnar, they are, they are known, known as the Tangals, that holy family. So, Tangals of Konnar, they played a pivotal role in the Malabar. They were fighting like anything against the British Empire. They were not yielding for any kind of uh, torture. I still remember in our tender age, when we are kids, there was an old mas masjid there. Yeah. In the walls of that masjid, small, small halls were there. Mm -hmm. People were saying that, old people were saying that, <laughs> it is British people fired from the other side of the river. Mm -hmm. And that went through that ball. Mm -hmm. Actually, people are not believing it, you know. Nobody knows what exactly is inside. Then for the renovation of that mosque, the existing mosque was demolished and the new work started. When it is demolished, we saw that. This much of length, you know, that bullets. Mm -hmm. We had collected that at that time. I, I, at the time of renovation of that mosque, I was involved. But before that, you know, people go to that mosque and I also go to that mosque. It is here nearby only. So, this bullet we have collected and it was kept in a uh, yeah. small uh, this thing, tin, like that. Plastic, small container. Then, uh, in between that, somebody might have come, some historians might have come. Anyhow, it was totally, we lost it. If that was remaining, you know, it would have been the best piece of yeah, yeah, history. Anyhow, after that, when the wall was, uh, like in that wall, also there was a hole like that. That, when we um, uh, started working on that, there we saw one, one single piece. I think yeah, that is still there. That is still there. Still there. They are preserving. And not only that, you know, there was a speciality with this uh, Tangal family. But they were very strong in the in the uh -huh. faith. They participated in this as if they are fighting for a noble cause. It is a noble war they did. There was no any kind of uh, force which can silence them. Mm -hmm. So they fought 
tooth and nail against British Empire and uh, there are many histories related to that. Similarly, in the Kodiyatur also you were saying about mm -hmm. Muhammad Bayan Sahib, I mean yeah, Muhammad yeah. Bayan Sahib. His last speech. His last speech, he was returning on the way only he died. Not only that, in the Kodiyatur also you can remember many names, popular names in this, uh, uh, in Pretty there also. Yeah. This and the uh, documentary was there. Yeah. You may try to get it. It is oh, a very, very good, uh, uh, my learned friend, uh, Mr. Uh, Randathani. He was there, he, myself, yeah. for the release of that uh, yeah. thing. So, in all these ways, what I am saying is, this village is having a very glorious past. Unfortunately, it has not been recorded. Now, you have come, thank you, thank you yeah. very much for that. Because you are, you, are, you are coming with a very good intention. Yeah, yeah. Because nowadays, you know, this local history, it is having its own prominence. Mm -hmm. No, people, normally they won't... Uh, do it, you know, recording and that kind of thing. Mm -hmm. So, not only that, you know, no, we are seniors. Yeah. And uh, if this batch of the seniors are completely gone, and then the new generation, they may not have any idea about this. Mm -hmm. So, we are all duty bound to make this in, into document, yeah. and that will surely inspire the budding generation. Mm -hmm. So, in that way, you are also associating with that. That is very good. Yeah.